Hey gang, Todd Duncan, uh, welcome to Sales Therapy. This is uh, a time for us to get together for a quick hit every week and uh, give me some time to share a thought with you that I'd like you to consider. The thought I wanna share this week is the question, are you in love with your clients? And this has a lot of different directions we could take it, but the primary direction is in the world of differentiated and disruptive service, you have to make your clients feel like you truly, truly, deeply love them. I know that sounds a little bit maybe soft, a little bit uh, mushy, a little bit uh, whatever, touchy-feely maybe, but the best customer service strategy on the planet is to have your clients know that you care, have your clients know that you love them. And so the question, um, are you falling in love with your clients, is a very real question. And what we know about the sale, if you will, what we know about the relationship is that people generally will buy with their heart before they will buy with their head. And even though they may start off in the head, it's always going to get to the heart. And I find that in life, heart is more important than head. Head is where we make our decisions. Heart is the catalyst for why we make the decisions, what decisions we might have to make. And around the client, it's everything that we do to take brilliant care of them. Uh, Dev and I uh, wrote the book, The $6,000 Egg. The, the theme around that book is stories about loving your clients. Peter Drucker said the, the, the battle for business is for the client's heart, not for their wallet. Uh, Tony Shea says from Zappos that we want to connect at the heart in every transaction we can, uh, as many times as we can for that customer. So it really is about the heart. And the, the second best customer strategy, service strategy, is don't break their heart. You know, a broken heart is a heart that needs to be healed. A, a, a customer that has a less than lovable experience. Uh, and and you, can, you can make this transition. You can start to see how just loving on your clients makes a difference. But if you break somebody's heart, they're going to defect. They're going to get out of the relationship. They're going to not trust you. They're going to leave. And so I think one of the themes for, you know, for your year and certainly a theme that, that we're focused on as we continue to reboot our um, customer heart strategy at the Duncan Group is love on them. I mean, love, love, love. Convey love. Uh, demonstrate love. Um, I'm not talking about being codependent. I'm just talking about having people feel that you really, really, really care. Part of how you do that is deeper questioning. Part of how you do that is with your expertise around um, <clears throat> helping them with financial decisions. Part of how you do that is with the artfulness of how you say thank you. Part of that is 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 how you communicate and, and how you connect. So I just want you to be thinking during the week and, and obviously during your lifetime, how do we love on our clients? How do we tell them we love them? How do we show them we love them? How do we make sure they know we're loving them? You do those things, I think you're gonna find business and life get better. All right, take care, we'll talk to you again soon.